Let's go into there some glue, which has got to go back in there. Put now onto the station. Yes, I know. One platform, which is that one, is longer than that one. But eventually they'll be both be longer. I plan to have them probably about up to there, maybe. I'm not too sure yet. Also, another idea I have is to have another point coming off there, somewhere in there, coming down here, well, to other small stations. That canopy there. Oh, I plan to get a Pico one instead and put that on the light somewhere, have it all mod nosed up inside there, etc. This telephone box will not actually go on the station, but it's just there for the meantime. And the idea for these small platforms is here, and having another canopy there, is for DMUs, the tank engines with the shuttles, and possibly EMU ideas. Well, EMUs will probably get in the future and have them running on there. It may mean I have to have more wood there, but still, it's supposed to look like a, I don't know, like a British Railways layout, somewhere in the 1950s and 60s, I don't know. And this stupid thing here, this, that has got to come off. It's been there for, since the last year, since we did this layout, which is quite And down in here, we have got some engines. I'm going to show you. As you can see, we've got three new engines. We've got a J50 tank there, an E2, these two I got for Christmas in 2010, and there's the Duchess, which has had its details put on, including these bright pops from the front one at the back, which is at the tender, but you can't see it, it's in the dark. This E2 here has had a bright pipe put on here at the front. I could put one in the back if I wanted to, but I haven't got any more left. And this J50 has been unable to have any details at the front because they haven't put anywhere at all whatsoever for it to go in, sadly. It could take a lot of work to do that. But still, another thing before I forget, these track the every single track you see on the light will be ballasted in time. Including all the way around there, all the sidings, blah 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 blah. Um inside of the tunnel will not be ballasted because it's just not worth it. Putting ballast inside a tunnel is just not, like I said, it's just not worth it. The ballast, if it will probably go up to somewhere around here, on both tracks, the same for down there. Down there somewhere. So it's just going to be a waste of ballast, isn't it? And of course this hill has got to be refurbished. So that's going to be another job for me. Now to end this with I'm going to show some New stuff I've recently acquired to wrap up the video. First of all today, along with the gloss coat you saw in the paint, I got the Hornby, the official 2011 handbook, which I will probably review at some point. I'll just quickly give you a quick debut of it in this video. Including a limited edition terrier from the Hornby Collectors Club. Only a thousand main. I'm going to have to get this. And etc, etc, etc. So there's the book. Now here are two other things I've also got today in the post. The first one is a Pico Loco Cradle. Or servicing Cradle, it says on the box. It's for, suitable for all gauges, as you can tell. For OO, HL. N-gauge and O-O-9 which size of the dot note is actually N-gauge well it's not actually N-gauge but to those of you that don't know just look it up on the internet and yeah, they're suitable for all different things which is the reason why I've got this also I've recently acquired a Backman LNER Peppercorn Pacific number 60157 Great, Great Eastern in BR Green with a light crest. As you can see, it's in the new Batman box. Okay, there is a part that has come off, which is a lamp hook, I believe. But I will stick that back on. It's quite unusual, to be quite honest, because Batman's packaging is supposed to protect the local more, despite not being 
environmental friendly. But there is some I want to do with this particular loco that I haven't done with another one, with any other loco before. But I'm not going to tell you what it is. It will be a surprise. You will see in an upcoming video. But it won't be one of the next ones. So until then, that's basically it, really, I have to say. Other than the fact that I will do more updates when I can. So, see ya.